And here we are. We, no, I done it again. This zooms in as soon as it turned on. There we are. Now, whoo, I'm just over the shed. I hardly get over yesterday, just on radar yesterday. I didn't get doing my battles. So I'm definitely gonna get doing battles today. But first of all, there is an update. Two updates, maybe. So, no. No, 12, uh, this is the current one. So, countdown to Pokemon Go to Kanto. Yeah, this is the current one we're doing, and I'm almost sure that I've got it completed. Yes. So, I went out for a run there, and it was an awesome run. So, I caught loads of Pokemon, but I forget what it was after. There was one I didn't have. Um, no, I think it was just the Shadow, and... The Shadow Snover, and I'd done it, I forgot I'd done it. So I had it completed and didn't realise. So there we are, it's all completed. And you can see underneath is... <laughs> you can sort of see underneath. Turtwig. Buzel. Piplop. No, that's Buzel. Char Char. An invisible Pokemon there. Um, Shadow Stunky. Shadow Snover. Cranidos and Shieldon. So here we go, we're going to claim this reward. There we are, get 3,000 Stardust, a Magnetic Lure, ooh, and some great Ultra Balls. Ultra Balls, so, hmm, what happens? In the field, evolve a Pokemon, part with Pokemon four times. Special, special research. So, a wee thing should come through, because then it's the last time going, where is it, where is it, why is my charger now then? Where's my badge? Where's my badge? Oh my goodness. Where'd my badge go? Okay, we'll go and check a badge in case it didn't come through to the screen. But um, that's what I've done the last time. So we'll check my XP and stuff over here. So, total XP 145.8. So, after I do my battle legs, I have about two of all's worth. Um, two lucky eggs worth of evolves to do. So I'm just trying to keep on top of it and just keep on doing it and doing it until I've had no candies or evolves left to do or I've made my 176 million. Uh, where are we? What am I looking for? I'm looking for this. Oh! It just goes to there and says two. So let me see these. I don't read them dates that way. Sixth of the first and 14th of the 1st, today's date would be the 14th of the 1st. So I've already got it, it's come through and I haven't realised it's come through. So it must have come through when i done, yes it did. Did I take a screenshot of it? We will check and find out, I haven't a clue. Let me see. Just hopefully there's um, nothing here that it shouldn't be showing. <laughs> That'd be funny. Yes, there it is. It came on the screen earlier and I forgot about that. Today, 0019. That's 20 past midnight. Tired, can't remember. Congratulations, you completed a collection challenge. So that's what it was. At midnight, the things always show up. The balloon. So my balloon must have been the Shadow Snover. And I've done it last night. So it just changes the two. So there we are. Um, we're back to Pokemon. So the update then is the next one has come through. And we'll go into news. And we will read a wee bit. Hmm. So we're on Sinnoh. And now uh, Hoenn. So what did I say the day's date was? 14th? It is Thursday the 14th, so next Tuesday, the 19th, we will go to the Hoenn region and we'll see what we have to do for that. Trainers, hello. We're excited to announce that Hoenn will be the next region featured in our countdown celebration leading up to the Pokemon Go Tour Kanto. He's excited. Tuesday, January 19th at 10am to Sunday at 8 
this is what's going to happen. Features Trico Torchic Mudkip. So Mudkip's good for your uh, wee swampert. Taylor Loudred Nose Pass. Now, although I don't use it, any time I'm up against it, it's it's pretty good. Um, Meditate Rosilia. Now, Rosilia's Community Day, isn't it, in February? But Rosilia's class. I did use Rosilia when I started the Battle League. Carvana, Nummel, Baltoy, and more will be appearing more frequently in the wild. If you're lucky, you might encounter a shiny Aron. I think, oh my goodness, it's starting to yawn. I think I do have a shiny iron. The following Pokemon will be hatching 5k eggs. Skitty, Iron, Corpish, Lilip, Anorith, Bagon, and Beldum. Mmm. Alright, I suppose the Beldum for the Meteorogross? Meri yeah, for the Metagross, I suppose is alright. Enjoy event exclusive field research tasks that reward Stardust and lead to encounters with Pokemon such as Trico, Torchic, Mudkip, Iron, Plusle, Minim, and Wilmer. The following Pokemon will be appearing in raids. Torchic, Trigo, Mudkip, Ralts, Aaron and Bagon will be appearing in one star raids. Bring on Mawile, Grumpig, I love Mawile, Mawile's class. Grumpig, Spinda and Absol will be appearing in three star raids. I'll definitely be doing some of them. I, I want the Shenny Spinda. Shenny Spinda is awesome looking. Now something is telling me I have one and I've forgotten about it. I'll check it out. Kyogre and Groudon will appear in the 5 star raids. I love Kyogre. Love Kyogre. So I'll definitely be doing some of that. Still don't have a Shiny. I want the Shiny. If there's Kyogre raid right about, I will be doing it. Complete the whole theme collection challenge during the event by collecting. Oh my goodness. Well, I've lost where I was, but. Oh, complete the whole theme collection challenge during the event by collecting Trico, Torchic, Mudkip, Ninkata. Nose pass, iron, plus all minimum bag on to receive three silver pineapps, XP, and an incense. Head on over to the debut track your progress. Evolving Metang, the evolved form of Beldum during the event to get a Metagross that knows Meteor Mash. Oh, class. So that'll save you a, a, a pass. Um, oh. See me with names again. The pass, what do you call it? Uh, I'll go to it in the, in the items. But, ah, uh, class. They cost a tenner, like, if you just want to buy one. Event exclusive timed research will be available. Complete the whole theme team research to uh, earn the following rewards. Catch two Kyogre to earn ten Kyogre candies. Oh, this is awesome. This is awesome. I will definitely be doing that. Like, I'll be, I'll be. So yeah, you're best then getting the three at once. So you're best finding, going to the poker stops and ditching other rewards and getting your um, catch two, two Kyogre to get ten candies on three or four of your wee rewards. So you're getting ten, twenty, thirty or forty then. Um, catch two ground on to earn 10 ground and candy, same again. Catch 30 Pokemon to earn 30 Pokeballs. Seriously. Complete all time research tasks to encounter a Rayquaza. Oh. Right, hold on, complete all the timed research tasks to, in what? to encounter a Rayquaza that knows the exclusive charge attack hurricane. As well as 3000 XP and Silver Pine Up Barry. Oh, you're getting a Rayquaza for it? Oh, oh, class! If you're extremely lucky, you might get a Shiny Rayquaza. I did get three in a row before doing them raids. Three Shinies in a row. A free bundle featuring three remote raid passes to help you challenge Skyrim Girl will be available in the game shop on Tuesday, 19th. And you get three passes. This is class with event, it's really good. I really like Kyogre, so I'm really looking forward to this and the, the Beldum. So we get the Meteor Mash. That is, that's, that's such a deal. And up next is Judo. So the following week, the 19th then. Um, no, the 19th is the... Uh, oh, I 
off again. The next one anyway is Juro. An event celebrating the Juro region will be happening from Tuesday to January 26th to Sunday the 31st. Stay tuned for more details. So we're on the Juro next. So there was something I need to check there. Yes. <laughs> the name of the item. Seriously. So you don't have to use one for me. Right, Rash? Elite Charge TM. I've got five of them, or three of them, but I'm saving them. God, I don't know what to use them on. <laughs> I still don't know what to use them on. But I'll not need one for the Meteor Mash. So I need a Matang or a Beldum that I can evolve here. So Beldum, B E L D U M. Bel oh, a PV a PVP 91 there. So any of them, if I evolve up, let me see if they're any good. Not bad. Um, yeah. That's a wee lucky one. Oh my goodness, Tara, what are you doing? Oh, and the Sherry's now, it's just terrible. So the old lad is, he doesn't need a That's wonder hit points. So, nothing major there. So, a Matang. I don't know if I've got a Matang. Seriously. I have one. <laughs> I've already checked it out there. Seriously. But there's plenty more to catch. And do I have? I have enough candy to do there. Yeah, so we're going to get a good... Um, let me see, do I have a Metagross? I don't think I've got one with the Meteor Mash, though. We'll check the IVs first. Oh, look at that. I remember uh, getting that maxing it out. It was on some some event. Um, oh, if it was in some event, maybe I do. So, Meteor Mash, let me see. Oh, Meteor Mash. Where's it maxed out? One? No. I don't know why I maxed it out. It was for. Hmm. 26th of seventh. Whatever was happening on 26th of July. No, that's when it was caught. It was. I think I got that. And it was. We were battling grunts. It was something to do with battling grunts. But, yeah. So. What I needed to do is see how much um, candies that I have for these because I am still doing loads of evolves to get between a million and two million a week by just using my evolves. So um, there's 588, so four for every hundred. So near say 600, there's 24 evolves for Trico, um, Torchic. Tor, oh, 435, not many. Um, Mudcap, I don't know if it's using mud. <laughs> 595, see, I'm low on everything. Um, Tailo, T A I. Oh, I need a gazillion of them. So 4,700. So two. For every hundred, so eighty ninety three there. So uh, yeah, that would get me loads of uh, XP um, for them. So I will be definitely at Loudred. Um, I'd never use that for battle league. So oh, look at that, seven thousand candy. So between the Loudred and the Tello, I need to catch. I need to just go out every day with incenses on and just catch a billion of them, and just evolve, evolve, evolve. <laughs> oh my goodness. <clears throat> now, where were we? Nose pass? <clears throat> I have a nose pass in 19A. <laughs> I have a thousand. Um, thousand candy, thousand fifty two. How much does it cost to evolve? Power up. How, how, what? How do you evolve them? I just do they not evolve? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Aaron, now I remember seeing debates 
uh, and this before uh, whether that is a good Pokemon or not so I've loads of candies here um, and it does look apart but there was huge arguments online um, about whether it is good or not so I have a 96.9 at 4000 so I am going to make so much XP um, by catching all these uh, rows yeah but you need them stones so that's no good um, so yeah there's there's loads here uh, I'm going to uh, register for trading um, I'm trying to organise there's a message coming a, a lucky trade for tomorrow um, Nummel Nummel and Baltoy Nummel and you am is that what Nummel goes into? I uh, have 1200 candy and then Baltoy so I have a s ah look at that 17 Whew, I'm gonna go through loads of I'm gonna make so much XP do you know it's gonna be do you know, two or three lucky eggs a day evolving it's gonna take me forever but it's gonna be worth it because I'm gonna make an absolute fortune in XP so yes I am well looking forward to that and I'm gonna get a meteor mash them as well and the Kyogres I have to get a shiny Kyogre so it's gonna be so busy from next Tuesday I am absolutely loving it just uh, I can't wait and all the candies that come with it too I just it is oh, it's so good and then you're getting a Rayquaza well, Harry Kate, I just, just I cannot wait so let me know what the best thing um, that you uh, think because mine is definitely well it's a god oh, it, it's it all I don't know it's gonna be XP there's gonna be I, I don't know what my favorite part is XP or the Kyogre and I can get a big pink fish do you know yeah can't wait okay that's me I'll be back to do some battle league very shortly over and out.